Hey everybody, this is GliderCat and it's time to play. We are back in Astral Colony. Let's get back to it. This episode, I want to try and connect to that planet. And I want to get our spacecraft built and unlocked from the tech tree. So last episode, we set up some production of motherboards. Let's grab those. Boom. And let's send those over to the lab here. And you go, oink. And we should, are we getting space? What else do you need? Aluminum bars. I thought I gave you a bunch. I put aluminum bars in here last episode. Did I not? Did I not? Man. Yeah, there's a bunch right there. What's going on? Space science. Oh, do we need another astronaut? We might. Let's see if I can turn off one of these other ones. Um, let's look at the tech tree. We got 82 biological, we got 351 chemistry. Hmm. Can I turn off the chemistry science? Chemistry, chemistry here. Boink. Will that kick on the space science? Um, I'm hoping, I'm hoping they will get reassigned. Oh man, is it gonna happen or not? Space science is turned on. Needs an astronaut. Motherboards. Did I not put them in? Yeah, we've got motherboards. Tons of them. And we've got tons of aluminum. So is it just a matter of our astronauts getting back to work? It's probably this guy. Come on, buddy. Eat your bread. All right. So we'll let him do his thing. Hopefully we'll start getting that space science researched. Uh, between episodes, I did a few things. I started clearing out a path where I want to connect up to the new planet that we're looking at. So I cleared this out. I actually used a couple small mining drills to clear a couple tiny deposits, and it actually wasn't too bad. Actually, it worked pretty quick. And then I moved um, this big mining drill over. Again, I don't know what the heck I'm even doing here, but we're leveling out some land or flattening this down. Uh, I didn't bother setting up storage this time. I guess I can just take it right out of the that hopper. And then I set up one new big mining drill. This one I, is what we set up, I think, last episode. I didn't do anything with that one, although it's probably ready to be moved. I'm guessing it's not pretty. Oh, it's still producing. Still digging. I wonder if they increase the depth. That looks, looks deeper than it was when I first tried the mining drill. And then I set one up on this huge um, carbon deposit. And did I put storage for this one? No. So we're just going to fetch the materials out of there. But we'll let this guy dig out. And this is kind of in our way as well. Like this path, if we want to connect up to another planet, it'd be nice to kind of do it straight down this line. We'll see. I don't know how many I want to um, connect it up. Ideally, we could mine them out quick and then uh, move on. This looks interesting. This uh, texture here, is this some special ore? or um? This meant to be quartz? Oh, I wonder if they changed the texture of the quartz. Easily distracted. Let's grab some, though, real quick. That uh, caught my eye. I was having a real hard time picking out the quartz now. It may just be that this deposit that happens to look different happens to be quartz. It may not be intentional. I don't really know. But we'll take it. All right. I think sometimes I'm having a hard time mining. There we go. Anyway, good enough on that. Let's start steering towards that planet and turn on the thrusters at a higher rate of speed. That's pretty much all I did between episodes. Uh, let's see. There's our planet or planet or planetoid. I think we need to drive past it somehow. Let's see if we can figure out what that's going to be. We're here, and can I kind of tell? Yeah, I want to go north, right? Past it, I want to pass it, and then kind of move over. We need to go mostly north till we get past this thing. Let's work on the thrusters to go north. Okay, this one. Going northwest. Just due north. 
There's north. Let's boom, crank this up. That guy's on feed. Then I'm not sure on the height. Maybe the map will tell us. Do we need to go down a little bit? I thought we did. Down or up. We need to go down just a tiny bit. Not much. But we can use the other thruster for that. Help us out on that front. That's you. And this one's turned off. Let's turn it on. And we want to go down. Up minus 19. Uh, we can keep this on 20 speed. We could even go lower speed than that. Because uh, it'll be easier to eyeball once we get close by. The other thing we want to unlock is ship control. So I'm just going to bring this down to like eight. I know that's going to be next to nothing. But uh, once we get a little closer, then we can eyeball the height a little better. All right, so we're on our way there. We're going to try and dismiss Abot's uh, never-ending quest for me using the Harpoon Connector. So we'll try and do that on this next planetoid if it works. If it works. Hopefully that will work, and I don't need to connect up to one of those tiny, tiny little um, planetoid things. All right, Tech Tree. Tree, we can tell... Hey, we're getting the space science. We get 11... I think we only need 12 or 15 for the spaceship. Let's take a look. Uh, we need 12. We have 11. Let's see how our little bread eaters are doing here. There it is. It's on its way. How are we doing on supplies? You've got plenty. Plenty of motherboards. We're making more of them, I believe, and plenty of aluminum. I don't know that I have any more aluminum I can give you. Uh, three. That's all good. Good, good, good. Let's unlock it. See what that's all about. Boom. Spacecraft. And we build it in the hangar that we placed last episode. We can indeed. It's going to take. How many? Just to one motherboard? <clears throat> Excuse me, I'm about ready to cough. Let's make one. Turn that on. Uh, one motherboard is not enough for something this cool. There it goes. Yeah, the cost needs to be upped significantly for these things. I I I feel a little anticlimactic when it takes one iron bar to make a spaceship. All right, let's extend this platform because we know we're gonna need to do it. Ooh, yeah, you can see we're moving past the planet now a lot faster. Let's get closer. Let's get closer. I'm going to bring down the speed here and I want to change my direction. This guy map. Oh yeah, we made a ton of progress and we're right at the right height. Uh, we could go down we're real close. Let me turn off the other thruster I've been using for up and down stuff. And then I want to head west, straight west a little bit. Want to get closer so we can kind of eyeball it a little better. So that's this guy. I think we've been using this guy for West. Uh, turn you back on. Yeah, you're only at three. How do we get West? There's West. View it. Pick it up a bit. In fact, we can kick it up all the way. Let's uh, monitor this for a minute. And again, I'm going to try and satisfy Abot. Abot's distant request. These two aren't too bad. This one ended up being quite a bit higher, right? But we could always chip off the bottom of that and make them look level. Not that we need to. Once we hook up to this planet, or planetoid, um, I 
want to work on getting this belt compressed. So putting down more miners on these two planetoids and the third one, and then we'll see if we can get the belts compressed. We're going to run the belt from the new planet straight through here, I think. Boom, and just join up with the main belt we've got going on. The other thing that's cool that I noticed here, we've got, there's a black hole way over there. That's kind of cool. I don't know if we could take the little spaceship over there and not jeopardize our station. Maybe we'll do that. Uh, we'll save the game <laughs> and then fly over to the black hole. Hopefully you guys can see it. It's straight where my crosshairs are, right above them. Um, I don't want to get the station near that, though. I think that means uh, game over. All right, we're starting to get closer. Definitely starting to get closer. Back up here. And then we'll turn the rockets off once we get um, too close. Boy, we're making pretty fast speed there. Let me make my way over here. Down to 40%. It's clear we need to go down a bit. Gonna send us down. So we're getting closer and we're going down. We're getting closer too fast. Way down. Okay, I think we're close enough. Turn this way down and then move back to where are we doing? We're doing west. Let's go north a little bit. Getting closer. This isn't uh, some big compelling planetoid for us. Okay, we're coming down and we should be passing this guy on the right. Still think we can go a bit lower. The other thing we want to unlock is the ship controls, right? We take a quick look at that. Where does that come into play? I think it is the space science. Uh, computers, plasma thruster, control panel right here. Remotely control all thrusters and find the optimal flight direction. What do we need for that? We got to clear these two. So two, 14 space science to clear these. In fact, we can do those right now. And we need, oh, we can do this one right now too. No, what do we need? What am I missing? Free space science. That's seven. Oh, is this? I'm not sure. We'll have to come back to that. Yeah, we're doing, ah, uh, I think we're low enough. Now we're real close. Turn this guy off. Still need to pass by. Yeah, we can fire up big time now. North and a tiny bit west. Uh, how about just north? Again, we want to dock over here somewhere. And we're going to start with the harpoon dock and see, like I said, clear that A-bot directive. Can out bigger, wider than I need. Um. Pump the fenders here, don't damage. Moving at a pretty good clip. A little bit. Uh, not 
too exciting looking, this one. Looks like the one we've already got. But we can try and mine this out and then fan it. Doing, did I go too low? Looks like we might need to go up a hair too, right? Do that, we'll slow things down a little bit. Boom. And then, what did I say? Yeah, we need to go up a hair. That's you. Just plain old up. Up. Give it a little juice. And back down. Far enough here. Let's turn this guy back. And what was it? You want to go? I think it was west. One off for now. We're at about the right height. Yeah, I think we want to go west. Maybe this is uh, a little preemptive. Let's uh, get rid of this. A little bit of this, anyway. We're going to snuggle up next to this thing. And put on the harpoon docks. See if we can pull it off. Let's take a look at the map and see how it looks like as far as being level. Oh man, that looks about perfect as far as the height. Oh man, just got a crash. All right. We are back. We just had a crash. The game crashed on us when we were in the map view. So we are back a little bit from where we were. Let's turn off our thrusters. Boom. And just assess where we're at. We need to go look at the map again. Hopefully it won't crash on us. Okay, now we need to come up a little bit. We need to come up a little bit. Do that. This guy. And go up, not down. Up just a little. We're getting west. That one's off. Okay, there's up at 40s. A little bit. Then I think we need to head, what is this, north? Uh, let's dismiss. Our persistent friend here. North on you. Okay, that's fine. That'll get us moving off to the uh, to the right of this thing. And we're trying to inch our way up. I'm gonna take this back like we did before we crashed. In time, pretty good. Some of that we'll probably put back, but as we're trying to navigate, going back in the map. Fingers crossed. Yeah, we got to go up a little bit more. Should be moving a little up right now and a little bit to the north, which is going to Help us pass the sky. Then we're going to head straight west. Get nice and close. And then we'll do the harpoon thing. I know we could probably do the harpoon and um, 
I'm guessing that would short circuit this whole process of lining up the planets, but uh, I kind of like it. <laughs> I kind of like the process of lining up the planets. That's why I'm doing it. So apologize if uh, you'd rather see me do it just directly with a harpoon and shortcut it. I kind of like this process. I'm going to turn off this rocket. I think we're at the right height. Boom. And now we need to go just a tiny bit north and start thinking about moving west. So let's see if can we get both of those. Something like this, I think, is the direction we need to head. Almost no north. We just need a little bit more north to clear the asteroid or clear the um, planet or planetoid. I'm not sure. Now, I had someone mention that these are actually planets, not planetoids. Let me know in the comments. Is this a planet or is this a planetoid? It doesn't look like a full-on planet to me, but maybe the planetoids are those little teeny tiny ones. Okay, we can stop going north or do very little north. West. I need a, just a little bit of north would be okay, but take a look. Pretty darn good. Pretty darn good. I like it. I like it. I like it. Okay. Just about enough on the north, I think. Go full west, and we can kick up the uh, thruster a little bit. West is who knows where. That's west. Boom. Moving into place pretty quick. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Maybe too quick. that for slow. <laughs> uh, I just want to get over here and get a good vantage point and see. Needs to come over a bit more, right? A bit more. This strip isn't... Uh, this strip is pretty close to being center, isn't it? Uh, we can go over quite a bit. Maybe connect over somewhere around here, right? Where it divots in here. Okay, let's kick it up a bit. That's you. Doesn't have to be perfect, perfect, perfect. Now, hopefully this little harpoon thing is going to work. I'm pretty close, right? I'm, I'm so close. <laughs> I don't need the harpoon. We're just going to eyeball this. Go a little bit more. You can see we're moving off to the right. Oh, man, we're getting real close to where I want to be. I think... Three, two, one, power down. All right, I like it. Going to do our little harpoon move here. We need to kind of connect up to this guy. Let's take a level here. That's probably okay. And <laughs> these are so... We're so close together. We, we're really close. Um, I don't know if the harpoon's going to have much to do. <laughs> These are really close together. All right, that's fine. It's fine, it's fine, it's fine. All right, boom. All right, Abot, are you watching? I hope you're watching. Is this not how we do it? Hmm. 
what could the issue be? Are we not supposed to hook up this way? Oh, you want to be right on the... Well, that one's sitting on the platform. What's going on here? Hmm. You're happy there. You're not happy there or there. Do I have stuff in the way? Everything looks nice and clean down here. Come on, I did a bunch of digging to make this nice. Kind of placement issue here. I think these two are supposed to connect up. Oh. Interesting how it's showing me there. I have limited options. What could that be related to? What could that be? Why would it only be those two and not? Strange. It's really strange to me. Why wouldn't I be able to build it right there? Hmm. Seems strange. Let's experiment for a bit. What if I... I take off these. Does that impact the calculation? No. What's so nice about those cubes. Hopefully you can see what I'm struggling with here. Not sure why they're they're only letting me build it off on the side here. Seems kind of strange. Back. Here we go one more out. I'll take it. Take it. I will take it. Okay, dock. Docked. And Clippy rejoices. Are you not entertained? Every food needs to be transported to the canteen before it's taken by the astronauts and consumed. Yeah. Aware we're doing that, kind of. Remember, we did. We could try that later. All right, this mission is completed. Let's uh, unhook and do the the better connection, right? This guy, yeah, only has two belts going in and out, so it's kind of like a tier one docking, I guess. But I don't want it. Oh man, I hit delete and uh, not sure what happened there with the screen. All right. Boom. Boom. Let's get the one we want. That's this big boy. Boom. And right there we'll do. Sure. Doc. I like it. I like it. Okay, we have achieved a main objective or one of our main objectives. Oh boy, we are probably gonna need to do the mining through here, right? We want a big, long stretch here that we can put, uh, what do we need? We only need, there's only four different ores on this particular rock, right? Map, is this the best way to find out the map? Click on this guy. Carbon, copper, gold, and uranium. So we could do, hmm, but we could mine this one out fast if we did like 16, right? A row of eight, and then right next to it, another row of eight miners. Um, four for each four. Kind of thinking that's what I want to do, but let's get, um, yeah, let's take advantage of one of the big mining drills here to level this area down for us. So let's start with a little platform that we can put that on. Here. Like this, right? A little more. Look nice. 
where I want you. Oh, that's nice. So we can kind of see through the, uh, the floor tiles. I didn't realize how nice that actually is. That's showing us the topology of the, um, of the rock underneath. That's going to help us place our mining drill here. I kind of like that. Uh, I don't like the fact that this is in green. What am I missing? Aluminum plates or something? Let's head back. See if we've got any. I don't know that we do. Happy in here it is. Grab those. Then here, aluminum bars. Let's uh, make more. Okay, that's going. And then maybe between episodes I can, or even during the episode, we can kind of chip away at this side, make it look a little better. Okay, please place. Okay, it will. Um, sure, we can start right there. We want to do the solar. Um, we're probably going to wiggle this guy. Well, we're going to wiggle this guy in two directions, right? We're going to come back a bit and we're going to come off to the right a bit. So let's put solar somewhere where we're not going to have to keep rebuilding it. Thinking way off to the side here. And what do we need? We need like eight of these drills, I think. So, ooh, hard to see a little bit. Just want this out of the way. Boom. One extra drop there by mistake. And let's make it look a little better. Kind of like the way that looks. It still looks like it's supported, but the drill isn't having to go through the floor. And then that'll kind of help clear out a path. We're going to extend this guy straight on through. So yeah, we're definitely going to have to move that to the left. I could have placed that probably a lot better than I did. I'm going to chip away at this back end. And maybe we can... Um, Go build the spaceship that we've unlocked or go look at it. Didn't we just get set that thing up to be crafted and I kind of totally forgot about it? Just do a little bit of this grunt work here. All right, that's enough of that. Is our spaceship sitting there? No. May have lost it during the crash, uh, when the game crashed. Can I make another one? Turn that on. Yeah, we just need need one motherboard, which me is crazy, crazy low quantity for a spaceship. We'll do it. Boom, and off it goes. I assume there's nothing in, yeah, we, the one we built must have got canceled. A bunch of extra mining drones here. I guess I could just take these up and recycle them. Doesn't look like they want to cross the breach here. Or maybe they would if I, well, we'll hold on to it. We'll hold on to it because we may be putting more mining drills down here. This particular planetoid has a ton of ore on it. The first one that we started on. So while we're waiting for our little ship, let's expand the platform here. This is going to be our main platform where that's going to host all our mining drills. I should have done that first. It would have helped me line up the mine a little better. The end of the world. Uh, should I set up another one? The thing is, they don't cover the full area, do they? Or do they? 
Can I put one right next to that? Let's try it. Try it. We got a minute. Uh, of course, I'm going to need a little tiny bit more platform. And hopefully I have the parts to do this. Extra to be safe. Boy, if these go right next to each other, that would be awesome. Meaning if they, they don't leave like a little wall of unmined rock, that would be nice. It actually looks like that's the case, right? There's the support. That would be cool. Now they probably don't go all the way back, do they? I uh, can't tell. No, yeah, they don't. So there's a little overlap here. If I put mining drills here, oops, up here on this surface, uh, there'd still be a little wall of rock we'd have to either hand chip away at or do something else with. Doesn't look like we're gonna need, well, we're gonna need, we're gonna need to do a little bit of hand chipping. There's our platform. Use some of this real quick. This has got to come down about two. Oh, we got a deposit there. Uh, that's a little bit of a drag. What is that? It is rock. Oh, piece of cake. Just one. I think we've only got to worry about this section here. Go check out the ship in a second here. I just want to get some of this grunt work done, sprinkle it through the episode. We're not spending too much time doing the boring stuff. Something down there. I thought I did. All right, let's get out. Our ship's sitting there waiting for us. Oh, yeah. Very cool. Let's do it. We got to take it for a ride, right? I don't want to leave it till next episode, even though could that's we're full of oxygen you know what hmm thinking i should save the game and we should go <laughs> we should go drive by the black hole maybe we'll do that at the top of next episode all right how do i get in f boom and what do i do oh pay for that at the rental okay then i'm zoomed out as Far as I can go. A okay, left shift is turbo. Here's that black hole. Can you see it? Okay, yeah, there's turbo. Doesn't look like it costs us anything, right? There's no fuel involved in this. And we're getting in indications on where our station is everything on <laughs> where our station is on the HUD up atop. So that's very cool. Where is the black hole? I'm curious. That is straight ahead. Whoops, not you. <laughs> I think that's our black hole. Um, I haven't saved yet. Let's uh, let's stop here. <laughs> End the episode here, and straight ahead, I think is a black. I think that's a black hole right above the crosshairs there. Um, maybe at the start of the next episode, we can go check that out and see what impact it has on our little ship here. I think we're getting closer. We're looking at it sideways. Uh, do we still have our HUD guidance? We do. So we can get back to base pretty easily. Yeah, there. That looks to be the black hole. Let's stop it here. And uh, next episode, we will make the trip into the black hole, cross over to the other side, and um, play Stardew Valley or whatever's on the other side of that black hole. We will see you next episode. For now, this is Gladdercat. And thanks so much for watching. Hope you're enjoying the series on Astro Colony. I need to thank Bladdercat patrons and channel members. Really appreciate your support. The 
channel has an uncertain future. So if you would like to help ensure that the Glider Cat channel can live on for another year, please do consider becoming a member or just clicking that thanks button. That would help tremendous. And uh, thanks to everybody that's been giving the videos a thumbs up and providing all the helpful comments and suggestions. Really, really appreciate it. And I'll see you all in the next episode.